finally almost gone. Yes, I will go first. Alrighty, so. Legacy, this looks really weird. <coughs> Alright, so this should be enough. We get Chalice on one in this format. And so, um, turn three, we play some of the true name, probably. Yeah, we keep this. It's okay, Six Monarch. That kind of stuff happens. Island. Go. Hi there, a Cookie. Hi there, Dev Clock. <coughs> Hi, only Ellie Rose, if I didn't say that already. Veteran Explorer. My dice really. Okay. Hi there, Rob. Happy MLK Day. I also started with an island, so it wasn't obvious what deck I was on, probably. Okay. It won't let me go. Alright, there we go. Oh yeah, because Prophet of Crewpix was banned in EDH, wasn't it? Oh, I know that one! I know scavenging ooze! <coughs> no blocks. Oh, another true name. So... What do I name with this one? Um, illusion, maybe? Or do I do Merfolk again? Let's do illusion. Blue, colorless blue. Protection from Sticky. <laughs> sticky is their name. <coughs> Excuse me. Creature can't be blocked, targeted, dealt damage, or enchanted by anything controlled by that player. So I can block the explorer or something, and I won't die, right? Alright, last man. Have fun. Or at least try. Hi there, kitty main! I believe that was the only change for EDH, though. If I block this, I get to go get basic lands. Right? Each player may search their library for up to two basic lands. And I have those. Okay. So they're doing this knowing that they're trading it for lands. Yes, please. Don't block it? Wait. What? You're, I mean, chat is too delayed, Carrick. Oh, that's awesome, Lost Man. Alright, um. Uh, my turn. Okay. Well, too late now. So now I've got one, two, three, four, five, six. So I can play true name. It only leaves me three. If 
But I could do true name fan or into master or true name into phantasmal image, copying true name. Bye, last man. All right. So Merfolk blue. True name. Pro from Sticky. What? You got six mana, right? I have six mana, yes. Yeah, phantasmal copying true name, phantasmal copying true name. And then oh. You want to have three true names. I will have three, but then I won't have... I played the true name. <sighs> Sorry. The chat is really far behind. Know, Hi there, Speaker Ender. I know, and I was trying to figure it out, and that's what I came up with, but it was wrong. Plus two, plus two. Right, I get that now. Okay, but maybe I'm holding up counter magic. Why won't? It? Oh, okay, it's their turn. Their priority. I, it's too late, love. You're watching it behind, like 30 seconds. Okay. All right. If it, they play Golgari Charm, you die. If they play Golgari Charm, I die. Why? What's yes. Golgari Charm? Yes. What? All creatures get minus one, minus one to one turn. Oh, that's pretty bad. Yeah, you have to play a lord and you have to remove your intruding zone. Okay, well, I don't know anything about Legacy. No, it's not about Legacy. It's just about, like, what can Trinity die to? It can die exactly. To die and that's a Legacy thing. <laughs> Ooh, I won! They must not have had it. <laughs> okay. <coughs> so what deck are we playing against? What did you see? Um, the one one that let us both get lands. What? I don't have names. Okay, you saw scavenging news, you saw kitchen things. Those were on your screen stuff. Yeah. Mostly by you, not by you. The That's black the green. green, yeah. Mostly by you. Um, so there's the black green. But they're non basics. We could do back to basics. Nah. Mind race. Um, probably submerged is not bad. If they control a forest and you control an island, you can pay it for free. Oh, that's probably good. And forest seems bad here. Nothing important to counter. Okay. I don't know how to use Jate very well. You equip it, you swing, you do broken things. Okay. Take out your forces. Alright. Uh, what else have you got? I have Manriki Kusari. Nope. Hercules Recall, Echoing Truth, Back to Basics, and Mind Break Trap. It's probably not bad to have one force in there. Yeah. Don't you don't think it's very high? Con conjugal Walrus. Hey there. Hi there, T TKD Tim, or Tim, we're just going to call you Tim. Yeah, I'm finally back. Uh, you can tell my voice is still a little rough, but... I don't actually know what all the decks are or what all the lists are, but I know what kind of cards exist. Right. So, so <coughs> come here and try and kill it, but I don't know who runs it or whether it's main or side. <coughs> yeah. Sorry about that, guys. It's probably going to happen all night. This is not keepable. Carrick is better. Mo uh, he's better -er than I am. Better. -er -er. Okay, this. Can we keep this? It's super slow. Need a vault into vial. And I have no blue mana, but I will have my vial. I don't know. It's modern people. Yeah. But I don't know if it's legacy. I don't know if it's legacy keepable. What the heck? Okay, what? Well, we can put a cavern of souls on top. That's true. <coughs> oh, conjugal walrus said that. Thank you. <coughs> oh, sorry. All right. So. Lead with muta vault, not cavern. So we have double blue. Okay. 
Okay. That is true. If they are gonna waste something, then I need my Muta Vault to be the one that dies, not my cavern. Now, this is why I'm in the tournament practice rooms. No money is on the line here. I'm actually just fumbling through trying to figure it out. This is how I started with modern too. I know, this is how I started with modern actually. But now the modern tournament practice rooms are really strange. Very, very strange because of the leagues. Oh, look. Blue. Oh, blue? Were they running blue last? Okay. Now we see in blue. All right, we got phantasmal image. So you actually can't really play anything unless you want No, but I can attack with my Muta Vault, just get some damage in. Merfolk, colorless, 2-2, two, two. Mm -hmm. yeah you can tell I'm feeling better, I'm actually like doodle doodling around again, what, did I do that when I tapped out, or oh, Okay. I mean, that's There's not. The entire book on how to I know. I don't, I think so. It's whatever list you gave me months ago, so it's an old list. But we haven't been following Legacy anyway. It's gonna be approximately close enough. I may lose the games because I don't have a perfectly tuned deck, but I'm gonna learn de the decks I'm playing against, which is kind of the point. Kitchen Finks, yeah, yeah, you gain your life, whatever. Where did their one damage come from? I only hit them for two, and now they've healed for two. What? Okay. Why, to scare them? Yes. I made the habit of not missing them. Okay. So, yes. Alright, so this time we can violin Lord and then copy it with Phantasmal Image unless cast the Phantasmal Image? No. You're right, I can't. I just chose Marfolk. Right, so you're gonna think ahead when you're doing your caverns. Um, well, I thought I was. If I draw any land then my true name is encounterable, which is better. Although, because 'cause I've got so many true drops, my vial is better at uh, two then up to three. So this is probably best. So we can Violin Lord... It's not best for this hand. It's not best for this hand? Correct. Okay. You know you Alright. Um. So I think I Violin a Lord and I attack with Need Walt. Yes. But I Violin the Lord on um, blocks, instant stuff. No, you do, it, you do it before you attack so they can't block. Oh, right. Island Walk. I forgot they had an island because they weren't playing blue last last game. <laughs> What'd you say? from the delta that's in their graveyard thank you yeah that makes way more sense I'm not as lost anymore They are offering me, well, not necessarily. Yeah, 
Yeah, they're choosing not to. Because you need the lands enough that I would give it to them to get it. Right. But they know that, so they won't give it to you. Okay. So, no blocks. I want to keep my lord alive. Thank you. Birthing pod. Oh, it's a pod deck. I have to read pod. Hold on. Right, pod was gone. So one in Phyrexian green, tap, sack a creature, search your library for a creature card with converted mana cost equal to one plus the creature's converted mana cost. Put that card on the battlefield, then shuffle your library. Only as a sorcery. So they're so going to get rid of Finx and get the, whatever, the brought back Finx and a four drop. Right? That's probably their plan. That or they're going to sack their one drop and get a two drop. Oh, they sack it, then I get lands. They won't do that. Okay. We'll see. Nope. nope. They did their kitchen things. So it'll persist. And then they go get a four drop. Yep. Rhino, maybe? Well, there's Sultai. They're Sultai. It's probably not Seed Rhino. Yeah. It's our first time playing against a birthing pod. <laughs> Murderous red cap. So we've got a combo going on. It is two and black red Phyrexian. Uh, it deals damage equal to the p its power to target creature player. So now he's just gonna loop. Well, if he gets murderous red cap. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's gonna kill the Lord. Okay. That sucks. Uh, so no, we want this on the vial on two. You want the vial on two for phantasmal image harbinger. Three for true name. Yeah, since none are great, I believe it on two. That's was that's what I was thinking. All right, we got another true name. We can make another Muta Vault, but that's still just another colorless mana. Right. Um, basically, they get to combo next turn. Right. I can't stop them unless if my Curse Catcher can do it. Well, they don't, they don't quite get to combo next turn. They have to have a sack out of them. They okay. Throw into here. Um, or, yeah, it could be that they're no combo. They're just solid value creatures. They could just be value creatures. So if we believe that, then we should probably file in Harbinger next turn. On um, to bounce something. Yeah, so just play Curse Catcher now. That way, if it is some sort of combo, I have a small chance of being able to counter it. Only if they tap out. That's I mean, yeah, it's unlikely that they're going to tap out. It's but better if they're, <coughs> value creatures. if they're value creatures, then they will be attacking. If they're attacking, then they can bounce. Yeah. Well, then they re enter the battlefield. Sure. Which is pretty bad. Is this a token, or is it it coming back? It came back. So don't bounce that one. It's unlikely there's any combo in this deck. They're just value creatures. Thank you, Apocalypse. Merge Red Cap hints at a combo to me. There's no reason. Yeah. If it was just Finx, I'd believe it. But right, Red Cap makes me makes me wonder. Yeah, they're not gonna let that explorer die. Murderous Red Cap lets them do two damage to something, but right now the only thing that is it can hit is Curse Catcher. And if I don't bounce it, well, actually, wait, can they replay it? Yes. So don't bounce it. Okay. So no blocks. Do I still bring in Harbinger, or should I bring in a Red Cap and kill his Red Cap? No, it's got Persist. Dang it! Ooh, I could bring in red cap and go get lands. Do it. Do it before blocks. Well, blocks have been declared. This is an instance. Okay. Sorry. Because red cap kill that thing, block a thing. That's what you'd want to do. I can still kill it, but I can't block. Yeah. All right. Well, then wait. 
You can't keep. No to doing it now, as to I can still kill something that's going to do damage to me. To oh, I'm going to kill the, the explorer right now. Mind. Oh well, it's too late now. <laughs> it's hard when I'm trying to use your brain, which isn't my brain. Yes, phantasmal image. Copy red cap. Two damage to veteran explorer. Oh, I can activate mute vault and block. No, you can't. You blocks. Oh, right, and pass blocks. Never mind. Thanks. Also, if you do it. Uh oh. Gogari charm. Regenerate each creature you control. So this will regenerate. <laughs> Oh, bummer! I really wanted those. Did you see what's no, I'm sorry. We're working on it. Three years as of a week ago. Celebrated late. Yeah, we celebrated today. Yeah, for our anniversary, we both got sick. <coughs> So now they're going to go get a five drop. Oh, this is so gross. Yeah. I love Birthing Pod. I wish I could play Birthing Pod in Modern. <laughs> now I see why it was such a good deck. I may have I may have been tempted to go to the Birthing Pod route. Because that's cool. You know, it reminds me, like, Yisan is a shitty version of it. Yes. Yisan is a fixed Birthing Pod. Huh. Interesting. <sighs> Drag Tusk is a problem. <coughs> yeah, this, this whole deck is a problem. Yeah, this is... Been playing with modern pod, except with legacy lands. Modern pod, legacy lands. Could be. No, veteran explorer is probably not modern. No, probably not. It's a little book. If that were modern, it would have to be banned. Okay, so... I feel like I pull it up to three for true name. Yeah, I think that's your own choice. And then you can phantasmal copy and then you can. I can't phantasmal unless I get blue. Hey, hey I got blue! <coughs> so I could do two true names. Um, they've already used a glory charm, so that's not bad. Yeah. Alright. <coughs> Sorry. You like true name what? True name on your lands. Yeah. And then hold do true name later on their on their instep? Or yeah, whenever. Uh yeah, a little bit, sorry. Um, I think talking a lot has kind of made me cough more. But I feel a lot better. Alright, so killer list. Blue, blue. True name. Protection from sticky. And pass the turn. No, it's got a 5 3. 2 2. No, no, it's not. <laughs> Thank you, Baskets. And Seek Render. Yes, leather, not sick, but I think we got that one wrong. Hey, Sirenismus. Um, part of it is also that I haven't been on for almost a week now because I've been very, very sick. Yeah, I had Thursday night, I had a micless Momier. Oh no! Mutilate, all creatures get minus one until end of turn for each swamp you control. Okay. Which is, everything dies. No, two. That's not a swamp yet. So everything but Thragtus dies. But I have my red cap back as a, as a minus Thragtus. one, minus one phantasmal image. Copy Thragtus. You get your own swaggy. Ha! <laughs> nice! I did not know the rules worked like that. I did not know the rules worked like that either. And now I get to go get my lands. <coughs> I did not get to make it to pre release Kitty Moon. I was much too sick to go out in public. Wait, 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 
I don't know if I hit the wrong button or not, so we'll do that. Yeah, I know, right, Little Wolf? Bannings are pretty significant. So now they have a beast and they get a six drop? Yep. With oh. Grave Titan! I know that card! Okay, what about instep? I know I have stuff to do. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I had never phantasmal imaged a persister undying creature before. So I had no idea that's how that worked. Alright. Yes, please. Protection from Sticky. Thank you. No. Now we get an Aether, another Aether Vial. Lovely. Alright, so we have... Five. You have a grave titan. Oh, I do have a grave titan. This is why Phantasm is better in Legacy, because you get more broken creatures. Yeah, that's pretty great. Mm. Alright, so, so wanna... I get a grave titan, a harbinger. Nope. But I can't attack, so I could have my vial and have an empty hand. Um, you don't want to use your harbinger. I don't want to use my harbinger without value. So, blue, blue, phantasmal image, copy Grave Titan. Ha ha! Should I? Oh no, my mutavolt will just get eaten. Alright, so combat. I do recommend playing the Yeah. His next move is probably Grizzlebrand. You think Grizzlebrand? Yeah. I guess that's seven, yeah. But then he hurts himself. And then draws all the cards. Yeah. But he'll probably go down to one life. Does Grizzlebrand have haste? No. So, yeah. It's still good. I mean, yeah, it's still good. I'm not saying it's not good. But he can't gain a life right away with attacking. My pen is here. Thanks, Speaker Ender. <laughs> I should be holding pen. I it's second main. It's second main pen. Well, no. From the instep where you kept saying instep at me. Uh, yeah, I should hold my pen. As cute as the instep pen is, I think you should probably break the habit. Very nice, little wolf. Affinity is one of the best decks at the moment. Soon to be hated out by everybody, but use it while you can. <laughs> that would be really funny as we render. I actually need to try to break the instep pin habit because it can get me in trouble in person. I don't know. Where is opponent? They have lost connection to the game. Maybe we'll win! <laughs> While we wait for opponent to get back, can we see the list? What? While we wait for the opponent to get back, can we see your list? See my list? Yeah. Okay. Um. Alright, because I don't even really know my list, so it's probably a good idea. Sword, sword. Oh yeah, I forgot I can do that. Okay, so lands and vile. Then we can scroll past it and you can see everything else. Hi there, Grinchiness! Uh, okay, so four Cavern Souls, four Mutavault, and the rest are islands, so we have 20 lands, and four Aether Vial. So, this is the list that I was given at one point, and it's the one I'm, I'm trying out.
We are trying out Legacy, but currently our opponent has lost connection to the game. So, thank you, Total P Clover. It's always a surprise when I sit down and play Legacy. So I have no idea what my opponents are going to do. And there's a lot of decks. Like, I thought it took me a long time to learn Modern. Legacy is much more varied, right? Legacy has a bigger metagame than Modern, and Modern is just huge right now. Right. Mm hmm All right, so let's talk through this. Second main, I want to play my Aether Vial off of my Mutavault, or my Cavern of Souls, so that if I need my Mutavault to block, I can. I shouldn't, but probably play it off my Cavern of Souls, because I can't use that at all any other way. And then hopefully we draw something that we can play. I don't really want to win by default. I'm going to learn more if they actually play against me. Hi there, Red Comet. I'm feeling a lot better, but my voice is not back all the way, and I don't have... My cough is still around. And hi there, Chase Harper. Yeah, after per persisting after a red cap, I had no idea that Phantasmal Image came back and got a trick, like copy something new. It was awesome. Persist technically says that. It's just we're used to dealing with tokens, not clones. Right, yeah, we're used to dealing with tokens, not clones, so. Yeah, Carrick Fop, Grizzlebrand. I did not get to pre release this weekend, Salamokos. I was much too sick to go out in public. Hey there, Portrait! Grizzlebrand is 8? I thought it was 7. Hmm. Yeah, that's what I thought. And there's like 7 instances of the number 7 on the card or something. It was super creepy. He did not! Well, he was sick too, so that's probably why. Portrait says it cost eight. Four, black, 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 black. Well, do the, like, bang thing. Yeah, eight mana. So, I don't know what their 7 drop might be. There's a bunch of good ones. Maybe it stops at 6. Maybe the choo -choo train just doesn't keep going. I mean, they could sacrifice a token, which is 0, and go get a 1 drop. Weird. Mm hmm. They could, they could start the train all over again. Yep. Maybe that's why they chose a Titan. Could be why they chose a Titan, because then they sacrifice a zombie. They're only down a third of a card that they then go to go get more cards. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's probably likely that they do end it at six. Grizzlebrand would make sense if it was seven, but they'd have to have a seven drop to get to that eight drop, and it's probably not worth it. Grave Titan's a six six death touch, that's pretty good. <coughs> mm. Sorry. What? Platinum Angel's not a bad 7 drop. Well, yeah, Platinum, Platinum Angel, but they're not in white at all. That's uh, 7 generic mana. Oh, Platinum Angel. Uh. You can't lose the game. Norn? Yeah, someone said Norn. But that's white, too. Or that is white. Yeah. Elish Norn's white. It doesn't mean they couldn't play it, but everything they have played has at least been part light in their colors. Like, Murder's Red Cap is black, black. Atarka, the new Dragon Lord. 
Dragon Lord of Tarka. Yeah, but that has red in it, and they're not playing red. Avenger Zendikar. Isn't that one red also? It's just green. Ooh, a Hornet Queen! Oh my goodness! It should be Hornet Queen. That'd be a fantastic card for them to have. Yeah, good, good get or good idea at least. Red Comet. Um, Walrus, if you want to whisper that to Carrick, he might be able to send it through. I guess that makes sense, Apocalypse. Hornet Queen into Crater Hoof would be very funny. Huge Somebody started watching... And this is a very, very boring game at the moment. So somebody started watching on Magic Online. Not to mention all the people who are watching on Twitch. Right. Well, we got my really grainy, gritty voice at the moment. But, you know, whatever. He said it didn't sound as bad as it sounds in my head. So, we'll see. I'd like for the, them to be able to come back. They lost connection at 7.49, though. That's about, there's like one minute till you win. Yeah, it's, they, we have like one minute. Does that mean we were ten minutes behind on the clock? I guess it's fair. We had to read all the cards. And, like, seriously think through every play because I don't know what I'm doing. Yet. All right, a cookie. See you later. Um, I might learn better in queues than free rooms. Hey, we won. We won. Hey, but I know so little that I think the free rooms are still going to be helpful enough right now, and I don't want to put money into losing tonight. That just does not sound like fun. <laughs> 